What's up lovers? How are you doing today? Today I am making a video that is very important as I say often but today I'm talking to you about three reasons why the size of your penis does not matter. I'm telling you, I'm speaking from experience. I, I've seen some huge one, I've seen some small one and sometimes the, the huge one is not the one doing the work. I'm telling you, I know you guys are worried. You think like, oh, they only one big, no. That is not true and that's not just from me that's from science today yes it's from science so i know you want to make a big impression but you just need to know actually what you're doing in the bedroom and all of this is gonna be okay i am telling you for women it's not as nearly important as you guys think you guys be putting that in your mind when we we don't really think about that like that so today i'm gonna let you know why bigger is not always better all right, so before we start, I created a Patreon at www.patreon.com slash Monaco so you guys can go over there and check me out. Please and thank you. All right, so let's jump right in. Why size does not matter as much as you guys think. Number one, ineffectiveness of penetration. A lot of you men think that the deeper you can go, the harder you can go that's how a woman is gonna come to have an orgasm i am telling you uh, it might work for some women i'm not telling you no women like it but i'm telling you that is not really how it works so i found a study that was saying that 75 percent of women do not reach orgasm from penetration so right there that lets you know that the size of your dick is not gonna really matter because we're still not gonna come 75 percent of us do not come from that. So you might have a big one, a small one, we're still not gonna come. Most women orgasm from clitoral stimulation. So the penis don't really play a part in it. If you really wanna please your women in the bedroom, stop worrying about the size of your dick and think about head, fingers, uh, tongue, uh, role play, the mood, tease, all that good shit. Think about that because that's what's gonna help her. Don't get me wrong, since we are talking about performing and being a better lover, I have something I wanna talk to you about and today I want to talk to you about joy mode. Remember the last time you were at the gas station and you saw like some erection pills and you were like, oh, that's tempting. But then you came back to your senses and you were like, well, sometimes that shit don't work. Sometimes it takes four hours to get rid of that thing, so I might go to, to the hospital, uh, the nasty side effect, all of that. So, Joy Mode is here to save the day. Yes, I'm sorry I'm yelling, but you need to get Joy Mode. It's all natural, and whether you are happy or unhappy with your performance, you can take Joy Mode to be better. Yes, just think about Joy Mode sexual performance booster as a pre-workout for sex. This is designed to support erection quality, firmness, and sex drive. Joy Mode was created because the product on the market were trash, trash. How to take it is really easy. You put it in six to eight ounces of water and you just drink it. Yes, that's it. But make sure you take it 45 minutes to four hours before you need to actually perform. If you want to spice things up and perform better in the bedroom, I would recommend you, you take Joy Mode and because you guys are my lovers, they are offering you 20% on your first order. So you just go to usejoymode.com slash Melly or you enter Melly at checkout and you get 20% off. Yes, go do it right now. The number two scientific reason that size don't matter is related to the vaginal structure. Yes, yeah, so okay, like I said, most women come from the clit, but there's also women that come from vaginal stimulation. Most women who come from vaginal stimulation, it's usually because the G-spot has been stimulated. Just think about the G-spot like the back door of the clit. So it's in the back, okay? And because it's in the back, it's not that far. It's only one inch inside the vagina. So one inch, that's all your dick needs to be, one inch. Also, you just gotta know where it's at. Also, a lot of the nerve endings that give a lot of pleasure to women are mostly in two inches radius in the vagina. Two inches. It's not, it's not that big. One more time. You don't need to have a monster dick. Like the average dick is 5.1 inch. If you got that, I think you're good. And number three, the porn myth. I told you that before, but you guys watch way too much porn and you be thinking that going hard, going deep, going like crazy, is what women want and that's how women come some might like it but not all the time you know like yes yeah, sometimes she wants you to be rough but not all the time 
So you guys gotta take that out of your head, you know, the over the top coming, oh my God, like all that dumb shit. This is a movie. Those are actors. This is fake. They are paid to portray a fantasy and you guys be thinking that's how women need to be. No, no sir. Those men are chosen for their size. Yes, because they got big dicks and they're like, okay, yeah, you, you come, you, you be in the movie. Yes, they are chosen for that. So in your mind, you're going to think like, oh, you're going to look at yours and you feel like yours is not as big. You're like, oh, damn, the woman is not going to like that. It's not true. It's fake. I'm sure when he's pounding her, she's not having a good time. She's just like, okay, let me go to work. <laughs> yes, that's it. It's a movie. I am telling you, big dicks are intimidating and often they fucking hurt. It can really cause injuries. I am letting you know. And in the long run, this is not the business. Like a girl that can take a big dick all the time, like, hey, hat to you, girl, but I'm good. I'd be like, ah, that's too big. <laughs> and I ran. I don't want it. Uh, you're gonna hurt my intestine. No, I'm good. A man might not even try. She might take it one night and the next night she's like, no, I'm good. Like, I'm still hurting. You know, she's walking like, oh my God, it's hurting. Yes, we're good on that. So do not worry. So that's all I have for you guys. You know, I know a lot of women are still gonna be like, well, I like a big dick and this, you know, that's what they have in their mind. That's what they're gonna talk about. But when they meet you, and you know what you're fucking doing, you know where to find the G-spot, you know how to stimulate the clit, you know what you're doing, she's never gonna complain. If you make a woman come, she's never gonna go to her friends and be like, he made me come, but his dick was small. Never. She'd be like, yo, this motherfucker knew what he was doing, he made me come 20 times. Not saying that's the standard, but you know, we're over-exaggerating here, but yes, if you make her come, she'll never complain about the size of your dick because it doesn't matter. She came, she had a good time. Your size cannot hurt the ability of you making a woman orgasm, I am telling you. Also something that we don't talk often, but if you can connect with her emotionally, I am telling you, she's gonna be more inclined to come. I am telling you. Sex is really mental for us. I don't know for you guys, but for us, it's really mental. So if we can connect with you, if we like you, most of the time, we're gonna like how you sex us, sex us. Yes, so stop worrying. Stop worrying about that dumb shit and make sure you know what you're doing. That's it, your dick is just an instrument. You just gotta know how to use it and use your finger and your tongue and all your ears, everything, everything, yes. All right, that's all I got. Hopefully you guys can like, share, comment, you can uh, follow me on Instagram at Melly Monica, Melly Love Exo, Melly Travels, all that good shit. Yes, Melly Motors, also. All right, I love you guys, and I'll talk to you.